What's up guys, the Gaming Workbench here, and um, today I'm going to be doing an updated tutorial on how to spread your background across dual monitors. Um, now the first thing you want to do is make sure both of your monitors are, are the same size, um, or else this probably isn't going to work. Um, but then you want to make sure they have the same resolution. And to do that, all you have to do is right click on your desktop, go to screen resolution, and then you can cycle through and make sure that they're at the same resolution. If they're not, um, go ahead and make them into the same resolution or else this isn't going to work. Um, now, what you want to do is you want to take the first number from both of the resolutions and add them together. Um, so for me, it would be, I would add 1920 by 1920 and that would be 3840. So let's just go ahead and get out a sticky note here and we're just gonna write 3840 and then you want to take the second number and just do it as an as it is so 1080 or whatever your resolution is let's just add spaces in there that way it's um, easier to see and then you can just exit out of that now what you want to do is go to a website where you could get this resolution for a background um, I personally recommend dualmonitorbackgrounds.com. They, I'm not affiliated with them, but they seem to be really good every time I've used them. Um, so now we'll just go to dualmonitorbackgrounds.com, and then um, you want to go up in the top right, change your preferences, and then if your resolution isn't in one of the presets it'll tell you the original resolution here so uh, 1920 by 1080 times 2 which basically means twice so two monitors um, if you're pre if you don't have a preset um, then just go down here and type in your resolution so it works the same way it's just they have automatic presets here so we're just going to select our resolution, or my resolution, and then you've got a ginormous variety of backgrounds for both of your monitors. Um, I'm just going to pick a random one here, and we're just going to go with the Huskies because I love puppy dogs. Um, thing you want to do is click on it, and then right click, save image as, and then save it in here, in wh wherever file you want to. Um, then you can go ahead and close out your browser. Um, if you want to keep this, you can, but I'm just going to close it out. Now what you want to do is you want to right click on your desktop, go to personalize, and then go to desktop background, and then you want to browse for your image. I already have mine under background here. I already did this once, so um, that's why there's two of them here. Um, so now that you've clicked on it, you may be wondering why I thought this was a dual monitor background. Why is it the same thing on both monitors? All you have to do is go to under the picture, picture position. You want to change that to tile instead of fill or stretch or anything else that you may have. You want to change it to tile. And then you want to save changes and now you've got your dual monitor background. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed. Quick note, I did get beta access, close beta access to Rainbow Six Siege, so I will be playing a lot of that and uploading um, if I can. I don't know if there's any rules against it. I doubt it, but um, yeah. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. If you like this video, like, subscribe, and then if you have any questions, leave them in, down in the comments below. Um, thank you for watching. I'll see you guys next time.